My name's Leonard, and I'm having a bad day. This morning, I woke up in a cart with my hands tied. A man with a large axe tried to chop off my head, and a dragon attempted to eat me. Oh, and I'm not wearing any trousers. Okay, I can survive without trousers for a while. I need to get out of here, avoid getting eaten by the dragon, and find a decent tailor. And if I ever meet anybody who remembers this and recognizes me, I'm going to deny it. And then maybe murder them. Just give me a minute. Just in case. Hear that? Storm clouds. Maybe we can reason with them. Um, I would say that was probably you being a little bit on the, uh... Okay, can you handle them? I, I'm not really much for fi fighting. I'm helping, I am help. See, ooh, I help. Yeah, please don't hit me. Let me see if I can get that door open. Yes, uh, ooh. Okay, trousers. Now... Out of curiosity, if if I were to wear a storm cloak uniform, let's keep moving. Okay, dude, they've got trousers. Uh, if I were to wear a storm cloak uniform, would you? Let's go. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. I, uh, no, you, you probably wouldn't hit me, but your friends might. This is really annoying. Okay, I'm blocking. I'm blocking. There you go. Apparently, I'm a little thirsty. Okay. Wait. Okay. Let's add. That dragon doesn't give up easy. Well, it's a dragon. Let's add not getting crushed by falling stonework to the list. Okay, more of them. You have a bow. I did. I didn't get a. I didn't get a bow. Okay. Yes, potions. Potions would be hand wine. That I could do with that right about now. Actually, would getting drunk be okay? You know what? I think right about now getting drunk might actually be a really good idea. Okay, well, I'm hungry as well. Pheasant breast. That's not too bad. It's uncooked. It's all uncooked. Um, okay, apples. Apples and wine. Wine, I guess. Not exactly... Well, let's think of it as a picnic. You're feeling well sated. Okay, fine. I'm... Um, this way. I'm ready, yes. Okay. Should I, um... Do we not close doors behind us? I mean, really, that is a terrible habit. Okay. Hadvart. People are fighting. The sensible thing to do would be to let them finish fighting and then go and find out if we like the winner. Apparently we like the winner. Please don't make up nonsense. Okay. So you're deaf. Hello. Come with us. We need to get out of here. Look at the dragonborn? You have no authority. Okay. Didn't you hear me? I said the keep is under attack. Wait a second. Looks like there's something in this cage. Don't bother with that. Lost the key ages ago. Poor fellow screamed for weeks. Okay, so well, it... we can get it open with some picks. I will. Need everything we can get. I like you thinking. Take all my things, please. Okay, we have permission. Excellent. Uh, it's been a long time since I've picked a lock. Believe it or not, I was once. An expert at this? Yes, indeed. Honest. Yes, I was. I was absolutely brilliant at it. But, you know, it... it oh! No! Oh, there you go! Coming back to me! Aha! Right! Okay. I was about to say, well, you know, it, it's a bit, bit rusty. It has been a while. Sp Ooh! Okay. You know what? It's, it's not the nicest garment, but hey! It has trousers. 
College boots. For oh good grief. Let let's uh let's let's drop those. Fur boots. Imperial light boots. That don't look too bad actually. Right, where where was Novice hood, novice robes. Uh, well, it's not exactly fabulous, but hey, it's got trousers, right? The hood's not... Actually, you know what? Hides my face a little. Therefore, nobody will remember me. I like it. Okay, I'm already carrying too much. I do hope that does not become a habit. And I now have a dagger. Oh, yes, that, that's a little more me. Yes. And a shield. That's not really very much me at all. However, it is something between... No way out that way. Are you sure? Hadvar, the gentleman there is telling us that uh, we're not going to have any joy this way. I'm not sure I believe him. He sound... Okay, I see some... Could you give me a second? More septin... And why do you guys keep leaving money on skeletons? Where are those skeletons keeping their money? Hadva? This way. Yeah, this way. Has somebody tunneled in here? Why would anybody tunnel in here? Have you been robbed or something? I mean, do you have some valuable treasure back in there? I'm only asking just in case we should come back and, you know, rescue it later for the Empire, once the dragon's gone. Okay, this does not exactly look... ...look like a tunnel, does it? Okay, get him, Hadvar! Hadvar, behind you, there's a... Lots of... Okay, that's a bit... Okay, lots of... Oh, God, Hadvar's in trouble. Okay. Oh, I'm out of stamina. I'm in trouble. Okay, I need... Is someone shooting us with arrows? Hadva, I believe... Oh, are you taking a potion? Good lad, good lad. Oh, God. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think we... we... Okay, worry about the... Worry about the... Yes, we'll worry about those in a second. I'll guard us both. You shoot them. See, I will use... There you go. Well done, well done, that man. I'm right behind you. You're doing great. Do we have something that could set fire to that? Oh, just... You don't even need my help, do you? I'm going to give it to you anyway. Oh! Well, I did my bit. Okay, just just give me, give me a second, dude. They've... Okay, bow. Arrows. Probably useful. Yes, indeed. Yeah, I know. This way, this way. Stop nagging me, please. You've got a bow. I don't have a bow. I've not used a bow before, but I suspect it's going to be a little safer for me to do that rather than run at them with a sword. It's not exactly a gentleman's weapon, is it? And it's a bit conspicuous. Oh my god, it's tiring to do that. Good grief. I tell you what, I'm going to stand behind you and take a few shots, but uh, only a few, because I want to keep a little bit of energy left for uh, emergencies. Okay. Out of curiosity. Just... Yeah, that, that's a little less tiring. Okay, I'm going to let you go first. Yes, you shall trip trap across the bridge before me. That... Okay. Maybe I should have gone first after all. I'm sorry, did you say something? I'm sorry, I can't hear you. Can you speak up? There's a bloody great waterfall there. I mean, can't you hear it? Even if you're deaf, you have to be able to feel that. Okay. Why are you running through the stream rather than at the edge? You're getting your boots wet. It's not like they're very nice boots, but still, dry is better. I'm sorry, did you say that doesn't go anywhere? You're very observant, aren't you? Oh, God. What? I tripped over. I'm actually damaged. 
Okay. Are you... Yeah. I thought we'd already established you will be going first. Apparently in stages. Oh. Ah. Spiders. Dude, you're being... Well, spat at. Okay. Okay, did I... I thought for a second I was going to shoot Hadvar. I mean... Okay. Hadvar, we, we seem to have more spiders. I mean, that's all I would need, really, isn't it? Okay. Accidentally shoot Hadvar and have to make my own way out of here. Yeah, that would be very unfortunate. Okay, these guys have... Venom? And a skeever tail. Why do I need a skeever tail? We'll, we'll figure that out later. Ooh. Egg sack. Spider eggs. I wonder if these are actually uh, edible. This... Really? I just... What did I do? Step on an arrow and cut myself? Oh my god. Spider eggs. It might, might be a delicacy. Somebody might pay us good money for those. Okay, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm... Hello. Okay. I'm just... I saw a body. And... Okay, potion of health and a dagger and... Now, somebody's been lighting fires around here, Hadvar. What? Speak up, man! I can't hear you! Dude! I, I really can't hear a word you're saying. Honestly, you're just mumbling away. All I can hear is water. Okay, I, I'm, I'm afraid I'm just going to have to take over. I say we sneak past this bear. He's obviously sneaking. I don't know what your plan was, but it was probably very silly. Okay. Are you sure it's sleeping? Is it breathing? It looks kind of dead. No, it's breathing. It's breathing. Are we going this way? We are? Easy, does it? Easy, yes. But let's not pat ourselves on the back too much, shall we? We just managed to sneak past a bear that was hibernating. Probably the most deep sleep there is. Not to mention the fact that it's a bear that's managing to sleep through the sound of a waterfall. Fairly sure we could have marched past with a band playing and not woken that thing up. This looks like the way I was trying to wonder if we'd ever Okay, this is out. I like out. Oh. Dragon. Okay. Looks we... like he's gone for good this time. We made it. But I don't think we should stick around to see if he comes back. Pff, really? The closest <laughs> town from Harry's Riverwood. My uncle's the blacksmith there. I'm sure he'd help you out. Okay. It's probably best if we split up. No, no, no. Wait, you have I an uncle who's a blacksmith? help today. And he'll help me out. But we should split up. I, I tell you what, look. You go first, but let me do the thinking. Okay, what is that? Listen, you should go to Solitude and join up with the Imperial Legion. We could really use someone like you. And if the rebels have themselves a dragon, General Tullius is the only one who can stop them. Wait, you think the rebels have a dragon? I, I seriously suspect they haven't reared it as a pet. They probably don't have a half-naked person with white hair rearing dragons for them. Call it a hunch. Okay, that really... See that ruin up there? Bleak Falls Barrow. I was about to I ask about boy. that. That place always used to give me nightmares. Draugr creeping down the mountain to climb through my window at night. That kind of thing. 
I admit, I still don't much like the look of it. Draugr. To be honest, yesterday I would have laughed at you. But we just ran away from a dragon. I, I suppose I should probably take things a little more seriously. I can't help but feel there might be treasure there. And dust. And spider webs. These are the Gorian stones. Three of the thirteen ancient standing stones that dot Skyrim's landscape. Go ahead and see for yourself. Okay. The Thief Stone. The Mage Stone. The Warrior Stone. Okay. He looks rather dashing. That was another sign of the thief sneak more effectively and inflict more sneak attack damage. Thief's pass. Path. They gain additional experience in two thief skills of their choosing. Okay, let, let, let's just get out of curiosity. Master of the Arcane, those under the sign of the mage cast more effective spells and scrolls, of course. Mage's path, they gain additional experience in two mage skills of their choosing. Ah. I'm going to take a wild stab in the dark. It grants me the ability to fly and have fire spout out of my nostrils. No, more experience in two skills. Well, that was a shock. I have a feeling... Well, this man looks a little more dashing, doesn't he? Yes, he does. Let's... Okay, the Thief Stone allows you to choose a Thief skill. You learn the chosen skill 20% faster. Speech. Sneak. Lockpicking. Light armor. Alchemy. Ooh, interesting. I like the idea of not being seen. And I like the idea of getting my own way. Yes, I do. Okay. That was useful. Listen, as far as I'm concerned, we've all been But until we get that control, Pardon for what, times, though? We never did care ascertain what charges I was uh, being brought up on. But yes, fine, I will avoid Imperial soldiers and General Tullius. Okay, walls. Um, feel free to dispatch them. Okay. Okay, no one here near Wolf Pelt. I can probably. I've got blood all over my blade. Do you do you have a handkerchief that I could use to wipe my blade down? I don't really want to put it away. That it's really. A bad idea to put a blade away with blood all over it. Almost a ribbon. Okay, I suppose I should probably put the bloody dagger away. And I, I do mean that in its literal sense. Okay, fine. I'm gonna sell it anyway. I need I need the money. I'll sell one of the daggers, the one with wolf blood all over it, and keep one of the other ones. And I will attempt to buy. A handkerchief for my sword. There's probably a technical term for it, isn't there? An oiled rag? Okay, Riverwood. This is very, um... Things look quiet enough here. Rustic. On, there's my uncle. Okay. Yes, and the people look... But... Oh, uncle dude. Alvar. Hello. There are chickens walking around in the street. What are you doing? Are you on leave from... That does not seem uh, oh, what hygienic. To you, Shh, Uncle, some kind please, of keep your voice down. I'm fine, but we should go inside to talk. What's going on? And who's this? Hi. He's a friend. Saved my life, in fact. Come on, I'll explain everything. Did but I? We need to go inside. Okay, okay, come inside then. Sigrid will get you something to eat, and you can tell me all about it. A dragon! I saw a dragon! What? what is it now, Mother? She saw a dragon. It wasn't that big, but it was it was pretty big. This man seems to think that I saved his life. I'm not totally sure what he's talking about. But you know what? If he thinks I saved his life, who am I to uh, destroy his illusions? Why is it we all have to walk in here one at a time? 
Couldn't one of you hold the door open for me? Please, come in. Sit down. Have a drink. Here's a nice outfit and some money. Hello, small child. Okay. Sigrid, Food! Company. I think I might be hungry. No, I'm not, actually. Okay. That's Dorothy. Where? Oh, the stairs over there. Okay. Probably, probably We've should. Been so worried about A gentleman's guide to white run. Must be hungry. Sit down and I'll get you something to eat. Okay, let's. Now then, boy. We'll have some food What's first, and then we will read that book. What are you doing here, looking like you lost an argument with a cave bear? I don't know where to stop. You know, I was assigned to General Tullius Escort. We were stopped in Helgen when we were attacked by a dragon. Can I take dragon? this? That's ridiculous. You aren't drunk, are you, boy? Apparently, I can. Husband, let him Snoopers. tell his story. Not much more to tell. This dragon flew over and just wrecked the whole place. I'm Mass hungry. confusion. I don't know if anyone else got out alive. I doubt I'd made it out myself if not for my friend here. I need to get back to. Really? I, I mean, thank you. I, 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 it was the least I, I could do. I thought you could help us out. Food, supplies, a place to stay. Of course. Any friend of Hadvar's is a friend of mine. I'm glad to help however I can. Okay. You could find like me. I said, I'm an glad outfit. to help in any way I can. But I need your help. We need your help. Ah. Uh, okay. What? What? Uh, oh, are you just. What? What does it take? Are you, are you giving me all of this? You're. You're giving me all of this. Are you. I'm not totally sure what's going needs on. To know if there's a dragon on the loose. Riverwood is defenseless. We need to get word to Jarl Balgraf in Whiterun to send whatever soldiers he can. If you'll do that for me, I'll be in your debt. Okay, go to. Do you have any supplies I could take? Okay, go to Whiterun and speak to the Jarl. I can do that if you could give me an outfit suitable for an audience with the Jarl and. Perhaps a horse to, to, to ride there, because I, I wouldn't want to walk. It's probably dangerous. Uh, do you have any supplies I could take? How do I get to Whiterun from here? Cross the river and then head north. River You'll see it just north. past the falls. Okay. When you get to Whiterun, just keep going up. When you get to the top of the hill, you're at Dragon's Reach, the Jarl's Palace. Palace? Okay. What can you tell me about the Jarl? Jarl Balgraf, he rules Whiterun Hold. A good man, perhaps a bit overcautious, but these are dangerous times. So far, he's managed to stay out of the war. I'm afraid it can't last, though. Okay, which side in the war does he favor? I don't think he likes either Ulfric or Elisif much. Who can blame him? But I've no doubt he'll prove loyal to the Empire in the end. He's no traitor. Okay, you support the Empire then. Who's Elisif? She's the Queen, isn't she? Ah, I forget you're new to Skyrim. Jarl Elisif, I should say. Although only because she was married to Jarl Torig when he was murdered. Ulfric murdered Torig, you know. Walked right into his palace in solitude and killed him. Shouted him to death. If you believe the stories. I'm sorry. That's what Shouted started this whole death. war. The Empire couldn't ignore that. Once the Jarls start killing each other, we're back to the bad old days. Okay, then. Uh, can I use your forge? Why would I want to use his forge? It's hot and smelly. What can you tell me about Riverwood? Gerda's family first settled here as woodcutters a few generations ago. She and Hod run the mill. I make a decent living sharpening axes and fixing the sawmill. Okay. Uh, what do you think about the war? People are rightly stirred up about the damn Thalmor being allowed to roam around arresting people. Just for worshipping Talos. Those are the elves in the uh, very cool looking Skyrim robes, apart, right? And maybe destroying the Empire? No. Ulfric will have a lot to answer for in the end. Nords have always supported the Empire, 
And the Empire has always been good for Skyrim. Okay. Do you have any water? Am I thirsty? Okay. Why are the Thalmor allowed to arrest people for worshipping Talos? Probably because they don't like him, but let's ask anyway. It's from that treaty that ended the Great War, remember? Yeah, when the vaguely. Emperor was forced by the Thalmor to outlaw Talos worship. We didn't pay much attention to it when I was a boy. Everyone still had their little shrine to Talos. But then, Ulfric and his sons of Skyrim started agitating about it. And sure enough, the Emperor had to crack down. Dragging people off in the middle of the night. One of the main causes of this war, if you ask me. Okay, then. Uh, do you have any water by any chance? Of course. I think I've actually got a skin. Oh, excellent. Okay, yes, right. And can I use your... I don't... Do you have any supplies I could take? Like I said, I'm glad to help in any way I can. Help yourself to whatever you need. Within reason. Okay. When you say within reason... What, what would you define as, uh, reason? So, for example... Am I still being reasonable? Okay. Hi, Keep Mom. safe. Did you really see a dragon? What did it look like? Did it have big teeth? Well, I'd better get back to work. Okay. You two make yourselves at home. Ooh, really? I'm going to rifle through your drawers and... F oh, they're empty. Okay, and find out if you've got anything decent to wear, although... Looking at you guys, I find that highly unlikely. What is so delight? Okay, that is a gem. Not a very valuable one. Curious. Very curious. Okay, well, no decent clothes, just a lot of food and the... Oh, I'll tell you what, let's take some garlic and uh, a leek and... Oh, cheese! Yeah, it's only goat cheese, but you know what? Ooh. Idar cheese wedge dried out. You know what? Let's take some herbs because... Oh! Okay. Let's see what I can cook. What can I make? Okay, cooking pots allow you to cook food that restores your health or provides other temporary effects. Nice. Stew. That's a... Oh, no. Pheasant roast. Definitely more my palate. Uh, vegetable soup? I don't mind soup, I suppose. Tomato soup, vegetable soup. Let's... Oh. Okay, well, at least I have some semi-decent food now. Now I will conclude this work by wishing you a great success in your pursuits of women and wine. I like your thinking. Spare a moment in your revels to think of me, your humble author, and the risks I have taken to bring you this most thorough report on all things of interest to the discerning gentleman in the grand city of Whiterun. Ah, but I will not lie and say that it was all a hardship. After all, who could want to sleep alone in such a cold and hard land as this? Not I. Okay, vaguely useful guide, I suppose. Don't really want blacksmith's shoes. Okay then. Right, well I have a few septims more and I wonder, will the blacksmith be doing any blacksmithing? Anytime soon. Iron boots, steel shield. This is not... Now, I'm already overloaded. I was thinking I could sell him some stuff and make a little money. Riverwood Trader. I have got a ton of junk that I would like to sell. I said no. No adventures, no theatrics, no thief chasing. Well, what are you going to do then, huh? Let's hear it. We are done talking about this. Oh. That's what... <clears throat> a customer. Uh, yes, a customer. Sorry, That's me, you. a customer. Okay. Yes, indeed. A customer. That is what I am. Thinking of buying something Maybe with... Maybe you could talk some sense into my pig-headed brother. Uh, why? You're not from around here. That makes two of us. Okay. 
Oh. Uh, pig-headed brother. Pleased to meet you. Riverwood Trader is still open. Feel free to shop. I shall. Riverwood do... Trader is everything you need in a general store. Do you sell spells? Do I care about that, really? I think I have a few old spell books laying about. If you want more, you'll have to go to the College of Winterhold. College? School? Uh, no thank you. I'm uh, way too much like uh, studying. Right, let's see what I can sell. Well, he bought some of my stuff, but he doesn't exactly have a wide selection of outfits. In fact, he's pretty much got nothing that I would dream of wearing. Did something happen? Uh, yeah, we, we did have a bit of a, a break-in. We, we still have plenty to sell. Robbers were only after one thing. Okay, An was it ornament, valuable? Solid gold in the shape of a dragon's claw. Solid Go, I, yo, oh yes, I could help you get the claw back. Absolutely, of course I could. You could? I've got some coin coming in from my last shipment. It's yours if you bring my claw back. This, now, if you're going oh. to get those thieves, okay. you should head to Bleak Falls Barrow, northwest of town. Oh. So this is your plan, Lucan? Yes. So now you don't have to go, do you? Oh, really? Well, I think your new helper here needs a guide. Wait, I'm sorry. No, I... By the eight, fine. But only to the edge of town. Well, I wasn't planning on leaving yet. I was not planning on leaving yet. I was going to, um... Consider some, some other activities. Okay. Out of curiosity, do you have a back door? I mean, I'm only asking just for safety reasons. Safety reasons. Definitely safety reasons. So she's going to show me... We have to go through town and across the bridge to get to Bleak Falls Barrow. I was... You can see it from here, though. The mountain just over the buildings. Yeah, I wasn't actually planning on going right Those now. Those thieves must be mad hiding out there. Those old crypts are filled with nothing but traps, trolls, and who knows what else. Right. You're not really convincing me that this is a good idea. Seriously, there are chickens walking around in about in your streets. They're probably doing their business. Oh god, I'm probably stepping in it. Don't think about it. Do not. I wonder why they only stole Lucan's golden claw. I mean, we have plenty of things in the shop that are worth just as much coin. Lucan really? found the claw about a year after he opened the store. He never quite explained where he got it. He's a tricky one. Okay. Could we go back to the bit where you were explaining the various items of value in your store? Sorry, I'm walking a little slower than you. Because I am very, very interested. You're not really going to walk me all the way there, are you? Really? He did say to the edge of town. This looks like the edge of town. And I do actually have some other things to do before before I go and rescue the claw for you obviously This is the bridge out of town the path up the mountain to the northwest Good leads grief. to Your Bleak Falls Barrow little... I guess I should get back to my brother he'll throw a fit if I take too long <laughs> such a child Okay yes you go back to your brother I will of course head off immediately and rescue the claw I say immediately. I, I need to just um, sort a few things out in town. Don't give me that look. I will. I will be doing it. I just need to know if you've got a tailor or anything like that. You have an inn, but I suspect they will not be selling clothes. Okay. Farmhouses. Not known for their excellent selection of clothing. Okay. Not a back door. But a top door. Okay. Let's just see what they have. Check in 
inside. Oh! Hello. What do you have? Oh, nice. Leather strips. Not really. Mm, no, no, thank you. Don't really want to be wandering around with very heavy gear. Songs of the Return. Can I? Okay. Still sent him off. We got tankard, altar, wine. Dresser! Come on! Come on! Merchants? No, it's not exactly... No, I, 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 I don't think so. What have we got? Songs of the Return. Uh, not exactly very valuable. Food. Another chest. Okay. There do not seem to be any shops around here. Roll of paper, septins. <sighs> okay. Now, it's probably not a good idea to try and take anything that's down there. However, everybody has to sleep eventually. Goat cheese. I've got a lot of cheese. I don't think I need any more right now. So, that wasn't particularly successful. Maybe somebody at the inn. May I don't know. Maybe there's a rich patron of the art staying at the inn. And it's Feindal's house. Okay, now if it's locked, that usually means nobody's home. Okay. Right. Let's just have a quick... Okay. Don't be stressed. Don't be stressed just because there might be a guard who's going to just glance over at you at any moment. There is nobody home. Excellent. Right. Okay. Septims and... Oh, minor healing. Potion of true shot. Ode to the Tundra Striders. You know what? That sounds interesting. I'm going to take it. My God, these people are poor. It's night. Nothing of real value and certainly no decent outfits. That and I actually have this disgusting urge to bathe now. Okay. Well, if it's night, everyone will be going back to their houses. And whilst night is a great time to skulk around, it's usually a pretty lousy time to walk through the front door or creep through the front door. Uh, oh, no, 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 no. I wanted to... It is 7.23. Right. Probably not asleep yet. Actually, they're still open. Let's go into the inn and find out if there are any interesting guests in the Sleeping Giant Inn. That and just... Oh, probably should get a room for the night. Orgnar, are you listening? Hard not to. The ale is going bad. We need to get a new batch. Okay, don't drink the ale. It's going... Do you hear me? Yep, ale's going bad. I guess you don't have potatoes in your ears after all. Just make sure we get a fresh batch in soon. Okay. Come on in. Just stoke the fire. Take a seat and get the cold out. I will. Delphine! Where that visitor been poking around? Poking? I've not been poking around. What? Sorry, what have you heard? I'm the innkeeper. It's Heard any rumors? Track of I'd like to rent a room. I would. I definitely don't want to be wandering around in the middle of the night. Uh, I'm going to be heading off to Whiterun, but not yet. So I'm going to rent a room, but I will do that later. Out of curiosity. Word is, Ulfric Stormcloak escaped from the Imperials. War is only going to get worse now. Okay. That is actually true, but not helpful. I, I, I was more worried about this rumor that I've been poking around. Because I've been doing no poking of any sort. Or no. We got rooms and food. Drink Can I use two. the alchemy lag? Like alchemy lag. Ain't much else to tell. Lag. Lab. Poisons and other things to, to make life easier for myself. I'm looking for work. Got any leads? Probably not the sort of work you 
Half of, you never know. You should always talk to the innkeepers, actually. Here, take a look at this. Some of the Jarl's men came by and left this bounty letter. A bounty. Kill the bandit leader located at Silent Man. No, not really my kind of thing, actually. Uh, can I use your alcohol? As long as you clean up, you know how to use it, right? I'm Mix always clean. Mix a couple clean. of ingredients together. See what happens. A little wheat and blister wart makes a healing potion, if you didn't know. I did actually know that. We have plenty of ingredients for sale, too. Oh, I will check your uh, your stock soon. Have you heard any there rumors? Been whispers. A boy up in Windhelm, name of Aventus Aretino, been trying to contact the Dark Brotherhood. Okay, that's probably stupid. Uh, talk to Aventus Aretino in Windhelm. Oh. Okay, why would I want to do that? Where can I learn more about magic? Don't care. I'd like to refill a, like a refill of water. No, I wouldn't. I'm going to talk to the blacksmith. He gives me water for free. Five gold? Okay, what do you have for sale? Take a look. I don't have anything to use in a healing potion, at least not that I know right now. What I should probably do is actually taste all of these. Believe it or not, that's the expert's way of learning what the items do. You eat them, and if you don't drop dead, they're probably okay. Sounds really sensible, doesn't it? Okay. Feindal! Did I see you talking to Sven? Maybe not. No. Maybe Never mind. But I would stay away from him if I were you. Can you train me better in archery? I have no interest in being better at archery. Uh, what's your problem with Sven? He's a bard, so he says. Nothing wrong with being a bard. It's time to do his job here at the mill. Thinks his ballads and sonnets are going to convince Camilla Valerius to marry him. As if she would say yes. Okay. An intelligent, beautiful woman like her wouldn't fall for that nonsense. I hope. Ooh. A love triangle. And where there's love, there's an opportunity to fleece people for lots of money. You hope. You don't sound very sure. You're right. When have words ever inspired feelings of love? Ooh, yes. That'll make him feel a little unsure, won't it? I don't need your jokes right now. But maybe you have a point. Maybe Camilla needs some help seeing Sven for what he is. Absolutely. Could you... Could you give her this letter and say it's from Sven? Oh. I think I've matched that Nord's lack of cleverness perfectly. Okay, I like your thinking. All right, then. Totally. Completely love your way of thinking, Embry. Sven! Feindal thinks he can woo Camilla Valerius away from me. She's already mine, I keep telling him. Okay. Feindal wanted me to deliver this letter to Camilla and say it was from you. I saw a dragon in Helgen. That seems an odd thing. Uh, should I tell him? Maybe he'll pay me more. Wait a minute. Actually, out of curiosity, excuse me a second. I'd better get going. Uh, where's it? Feindal, um, forgot to ask, but... Tell me, as soon as you've given Camilla the letter. Well, no, what I, what right. I was actually thinking was uh, you're going to pay me, but apparently not, in which case. Sven. You look like a traveler. Someone that has seen faraway places and heard new stories. Where did you learn to play so well? At the Bard's College in Solitude. They train bards and skalds like myself. If you go there, talk to Viarmo. He's the headmaster. Bard school. That could be interesting, actually. Being a bard gives you access to uh, lots of interesting places. People don't moment, think of the musician in the corner, the singer. They'll invite them in, offer them money and a free place to stay, and they can pick up all sorts of rumors and do all sorts of... Interesting things. Can I make a request? Uh, no, that guy over there told me to deliver this letter. It's terrible. I would never do that. <sighs> what is this? The elf playing a treachery? Shocking. As if I would write this dribble. How about we play a bit of a turnabout with Fendel? Okay. Here. I had to use simple words, but this letter should convince Camilla it's from him. Okay, uh, out of curiosity, am I going... Can we... Is there someone I could buy fresh supplies? No, I want... Who is Camilla? Who is Camilla? Why would I want to give her these letters? Wait. Is that the woman from the traders? Embry! Hello! Embry? Hello? What are you staring at? Here, have a drink on me, or... No. Okay, so... I'm just looking around, I'm thinking... Uh, 
I'm thinking of uh, hire, of renting a room. I'd like to rent this one. Can I rent this one? You're that visitor been poking around. I don't poke around. I was looking in there to check the quality of the accommodations before giving you ten gold. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Excellent. Thank you very much. It's very, very nice. You can go away now. Okay. Let me guess. This is not my room? This is my room! This pokey little thing with the... There's a dead animal on this bed! I mean, come on, seriously! This room has space! It has sheets! It's reasonably clear! This is a decent room! Not to mention the fact that it's well stocked and I... I know, it's not my room! 